Now, shout out to Living Ichigo, of course, because I'm using his video inside my video. I'm going to source his video down below in the description. N this team right over here, I remember doing a video on who's the best god lead. And on this team, physical full power Frieza, there's a number that he hit that I was so surprised. Was it like, I know it's above 500k, it had to be, because... This guy was hitting a pretty nice attack stat on a double god-led team for this uh, physical S LSSJ Broly. I think that on a double god-led like, team, oh my god. This physical full power Frieza, although like pre-Easy A, all he was doing was getting 120% attack and forming a super attack. You guys already know, you get the most out of your attack when performing a super attack rather than just starting out with the attack buff but this guy back in 2016 was hitting like a freight train and i'm pretty sure there was a bunch of units that did have this proc of 120 percent attack and defense when performing a super attack or they start out with just 120 percent attack i'm pretty sure there was a bunch of units back then and when they went into 2017 where they would give units above a hundred percent attack modifier now let's go ahead and talk about physical full power freezer today and i'm pretty surprised that i haven't spoke about this guy i was skimming through my unit review playlist which i recommend you guys check out if there's a unit that you want me to talk about and i've already talked about it it's probably inside my unit review playlist so i think that physical full power freezer during your leader skill slash dokkan event meta i'm still calling it that i'm not going to call it the dokkan event meta i think he was pretty god damn good and he had a very impressive showing back then because as you guys know 2016 offense 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 is the meta and what did this guy bring to the table he brought offense and not only did he bring offense but he did technically have a actual runnable leader skill back then that being the three key and three thousand attack to a specific typing that being physical but of course a better leader will come out that being the physical lssj broly and obviously you will be able to throw this guy on this team so this guy being the absolute offensive demon that he was uh physical full power frieza was packing up bosses and i want to go ahead and showcase that real quick of course i gotta say it again shout out my dog living ichigo if this guy did not exist it'd be kind of hard trying to find some of these videos of course i have d free rhyme style all these other cats but hey I gotta give my flowers to all these old school Dokkan creators because they're just goats. They are goats. So what do we have here? I'm pretty sure that physical Bardock, isn't he a support type unit? That's the SSR version of him too. I just want to go ahead and check real quick. Where is this Bardock? He's right over here. Let me get the SSR, see if he supports. Uh, he only gives two key for all allies when his hp is 50 percent or above or when your hp is 50 percent or above okay so he just gives key i mean that's cool i guess and then that goku i don't remember what he does but he doesn't do anything that's worth looking up all right so this is full power freeze i'm pretty sure he's gonna die here though right the goku goku's probably gonna die here i think he does I'm about to see right here no he doesn't okay cool 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 he's not gonna kill him off i want to see full power freeze uh, do the damage I'm pretty sure he hit a nice number. Ah, it was only 300k. This cannot be true. I'm skipping through the video a little bit more to find a... Okay, so he keeps Fizzle Kid Boo on rotation. I... Bro. Because this guy has big bad bosses, right? Yeah. He has big bad bosses. Okay. So, there's no way in hell there's not going to be a nice attack stat here. So, we're going to... Let's see this one more time. There is no... I refuse to believe it that that 300k was all he can hit because kid boo's gonna support ah only 346k frieza come on man i remember this guy hitting so much more harder i think it was in another video believe me guys he can definitely hit over 500k back in 2016 but i guess this was just the wrong video i mean 300k still not too shabby with not that great of a linking partner which of course in true Devin style, I completely forgot to bring up the goddamn best slinging partners. Let me just go ahead and over to Frieza. Let me pull up. Where is Frieza? Frieza, Frieza, Frieza. Where are you? Is he anywhere to be found? Where is this unit? Bro, why can I never find units when I'm doing the video? And then, like, when I'm, like, not recording, I find the unit instantly. Where is he? Bro, 
There he is. Yo, like, he's just hiding from me. Uh, who could have you sat him right next to back in 2016? I, I don't even know. Because none of these guys existed back in 2016, clearly. Uh, I mean, this guy? When he comes out in 2017? Yeah? I mean, you could technically go ahead and throw this guy. When, when exactly does Physical Final Form Cooler come out in 2017? Because, believe it or not, where's Physical Final Form Cooler? Believe it or not, these two can actually run quite well with one another. And when this guy does get his EZA in April of 2018, he doesn't have a actual runnable category to throw this guy on. All he really has to fall back on in terms of leader skill is this guy, which I'm not really a fan of because in 2018, if you really think about it, let me just go ahead and map this out. So plan Namek Saga, right? Category here. It doesn't get a real leader skill till 2019 with this uh, Goku. Yes, May of 2019. Uh, let's see another one. Full power. Full power is the year of physical Dragon Ball Super Broly. And full power, well, excuse me, super full power, super full power, Super Saiyan 4 Goku does not come out till July of 2018. Okay, yes, true, July 2018. And guess what? The fucker doesn't get <laughs> help because he's out during April of 2018. So he's checked off the list and he's checked off the list. Uh, another one, transformation boost. People, when does STR Super Boo come out? Do we know class? STR Super Boo comes out in October of 2018. So just to pull that up on the screen so I can prove that that is the correct answer. Yes, October of 2018. Oh, one more thing, class. When does, let me just X this guy out. When does, uh, uh, let's see, let me go back on over to Transformation Boost. When does, of course, STR Cooler come out? Come on, you guys gotta know this one. He comes out Halloween of 2019. It's like this man released with an easy A, but no goddamn leader skill. <laughs> Let me just pull it up to just prove that the answer is correct. Yeah. Halloween of 2019, guys. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> and then one more thing, just to further prove the point. I mean, look at Bloodline. When does AJ Metal Cooler come out? He comes out Halloween of 2018. Right there. There it is. <laughs> come on. My man's released with no real runnable category leader skill to throw him on. And of course, Terrifying Conquerors is obviously... Terrifying Conquerors doesn't get a real category lead until STR Cooler comes out. So that's essentially a full, like, year and a half away. So, Frieza's sitting here with his best leader skill being... Where is he? Did I, did I click off of him? His best leader skill being a mono physical team. Oh, a mono extreme physical team on the uh, physical coolest team and although they can work well with one another when this guy is able to be ran on an actual 170 percent attack lead get out of his way but they didn't really change much about him besides of course give him stat boost as well as give him a defense from his super attack effect all the way over to his passive which i really like that he gains three key and 30 percent defense as the first attack on a turn and he builds up defense by 30 percent for three turns as well as he gets more stat buffs this guy getting up to 17,000 attack damn near 18,000 attack is really nice because he just hits much more harder and he's able to get those links active because guess what guess who is chilling on transformation boost with this guy i mean we we do have physical final form cooler on here correct uh, yes, he's right over here. So you can, in all actuality, run a rotation with this guy and physical final form cooler, and they can work relatively well. So let's go ahead and see how many 200% leader skills this physical full power Frieza is on. So physical full power Frieza is on six 200% leader skills? Uh, you, yo, you could have fooled me. Six? Damn. For a 2016 unit to have over at least... I don't know, like three 200% leader skills? That's impressive. That is pretty goddamn impressive. Okay, so he's on Captain Ginyu's 200% leader skill, two Terrifying Conquerors, Plan Amic Saga, and Space Traveling Warriors. He's on uh, Kale's 200% leader skill, the Transformation Boost in Full Power. He's on, of course, LR Metal Cooler's 200% leader skill, the Wicked Bloodline. He's on LR Final Form Cooler's 200% leader skill, the Terrifying Conquerors and Transformation Boost. He's also on Majunior's 200% leader skill, to Gifted Warriors, Terrifying Conquerors, and Battle of Fate. And lastly, he's on the 200% leader skill of Battle of Fate, 
to final trump card from the LRGT boy. Six 200% leader skills. I'm I'm impressed, I gotta say. From a unit that's from 2016, if you have over three 200% leader skills, that is a big, big W. It's pretty nice because, hey, one day if we get super easy A's, okay, we get super easy A's someday, this guy becomes an absolute complete juggernaut. That'd be ridiculous, all right? So what is good about physical full power Frieza is that he did have a rare leader skill of 3 key and 3000 attack during the meta where leader skills were important for typings. So he had a good leader skill, he did immense, and of course he gained a big substantial amount of attack when performing a super attack, that being 120%, and this guy has big bad bosses. Him being a big bad boss is damage dealer that has an actual runnable leader skill for 2016 made him a good unit. For sure because that was an offense oriented meta and of course what is good about him post eza is that he gets a god leader he gets defense on super for multiple turns and he gains key and defense as a first attack on a turn so this guy not on top of like all the defense that he's getting he's also <laughs> hitting much more harder because guess what eza's boost stats <laughs> so hey hey this guy's hitting a lot more harder, man. It's like he's on some Dokkan Fest level rainbow attack type stuff. So what is uh, bad about physical full power Frieza? I think the only only issue I have with this guy hmm, is that he has to get his key in defense as the first attack on the turn. That's it. I wish that he gained a little bit more defense and he didn't have that restriction as the first attack on the turn because obviously now that didn't really age well because he's not a good slot one unit but if they just made that unrestricted to any slot for attacking and they gave him like what's that like 120 percent defense with that three key then it would have been nice but other than that i don't have an issue with this guy for sure i feel like when he had first got his easy a in april of 2018 he had to wait for his category leaders to come out like for example he had to wait for the uh, super full power saying for goku to come out of course in july of 2018 he had to wait for the str super blue to come out in october of 2018 he had to wait for the agio metal cooler to come out in halloween of 2018 he had to wait for options to come out but that's not really a problem with him it's more so a problem with you know dokkan releasing this guy's easy a around the time they did so pretty much the only issue i have with them is that first attack on the turn thing and that's it that's really about it i was gonna say something about this guy but i completely forgot it's not really that important but yeah i appreciate you guys for watching you guys are the best i'll catch you guys next video i love you all peace